hello everyone welcome to our channel once again please leave a like on this video and subscribe to our channel for more updates and also leave a comment to express your thoughts on this the leader of the pan yoruba social political group afeni ferre ayo adibanjo has said the all progressive congress presidential candidate bola tinubu had always won elections in lagos state through thuggery bribery and corruption adibanjo made this known on monday while reacting to the victory of labor party flag bearer peter obi in lagos state Reports gather that Peter Obi polled 582,454 votes to defeat Tinubu, who scored 572,606 votes, while the People's Democratic Party candidate Atiku Abubakar came third with 75,750 votes. Reports also gathered that the Adebanjo support for Tinubu ahead of the election said the results proved the re the, that the youths are, are ready to take back their country. According to him, it was a miracle for Peter Obi to win in Lagos, considering the thugs and obas who were campaigning against him. He said Obi's victory in Lagos in the presidential election is the wish of the people. Tinubu has always won in Lagos by thuggery, by bribery and corruption, but the youths are awake now. That's why they are attacking the Igbos so as to make it look like it, look like it is a Yoruba affair. Although it is a miracle for us to win in Lagos with all the violence because all the Obas are campaigning against us. The message all over the country is that the youths are now awake to take. Well, Obi winning the presidential election in Lagos is really a miracle. You know, since 1999 till date, uh, since 1999 till 2019, you know, uh, Tunubu has never lost election. You know, either by himself or anyone he's supporting in Lagos State. So uh, it, 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 it was surprising to see that Peter Obi of the Labour Party won, you know, uh, the presidential election in Lagos. And and uh, uh, he, he, to, to me, it uh, when, when Chief Adeban just said it's a miracle. To me, if there's any word that can be used to describe uh, what happened in Lagos during this election, you know. Uh, it's really uh, beyond everybody's expectation. To be honest, uh, Lagos is not one of those places that you can just, uh, you know, you know, push, push, uh, you know, have a pushover, push the APC over when it comes to the presidential election. You know, uh, since 1990, you know, APC has always won election in Lagos, but uh, Labour Party winning. This presidential election in Lagos is a is a sign that Nigerians are tired of the APC you know, uh, government and they needed a change. But like what uh, Chief Adeban just said that uh, Tunubu has always won election, you know, uh, through uh, won election through thuggery, you know, uh, bribery, and uh, you know, all kind of. Uh, you know, election practices is, is 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 not false because with what is happening in this presidential election, uh, you know, it shows what the APC you know uh, are gifted in. They they are master in election electoral fraud. That is just it. I I don't want to bend this thing. I don't want to paint it. You know, I just want to say the way it is. Because if you take a look of what has happened, even in Lagos, if this election was done free and fair, you know, uh, Labour Party would have won this election with a very high margin. Because of the pranks that were played in electoral process, that was that is the reason why you see that uh, you know Labour Party just won the election with 10,000 votes. Normally, with the the support of the youth. And all that they, they uh, with what, 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 you know, with what was on ground, and how the supporters of Labour Party came out to vote, you know, uh, APC will have floated, you know, uh, 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 Labour Party will have won AC, APC with over 10,000, 200, you know, 100,000 votes. But because of, you know, the Lagos factor, the APC, the Bola Ashwaju, you know, and the the Tulgray, at the attack, the influence of the, the government in the electoral process inducing INEC, that is why you see this small margin. You know, that's why we see this small margin. 
Now, the, the all the things that happened in, in, in the uh, Lagos election, the presidential election, after they have declared, you know, the Labour Party winner, no, nobody is talking about them again. But the truth is, the evil will fear will one day come over us. Because the, the, the game that was played here, they knew that if they have given this electro, uh, Lagos election to to Bola Ahmed Tunubu, you know, there will have been a big crisis, protest and all that in Lagos. So what they did was, they make the 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 the, the election the, the the number of the vote, you know, uh, they, they gave it to they gave it to Peter Obi, but making the margin very small. That is one game they played here. But they know that no how there's no way Bola Ahmed would have even scored what he had if there was no electoral manipulation in the system. So they played the game, they played very wise and concentrated in other states where you know, labor, uh, the youth, does not have the kind of force that they have in Lagos. Yes, like other southwest states, that youth does not have the kind of force that they have in Lagos. And they capitalize on those states and this thing and the other. Now, when they go to the north, they also play the game with the northern governors. Don't forget that. Don't forget that. The not all the not most of the northern governors are supporting Bola Ahmed Tunubu. They are APC members, and uh, they not had the vote in terms of you know the numbers of voter, vote, uh, uh, registered voters, and they capitalize on that. So plus or minus, if you listen to, if you take, if you want to analyze the the uh, what uh, Chief Adebanjo has said, is 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 a purely truth, because presently. All the electoral observers, the Olusegun uh, Obasanjo, uh, you know, uh, Abbasale Mabubaka, all the eminent Nigeria has come out to condemn the process of this election, that this election is not free and fair and credible. Even the United Nations, the European Union observers, everybody has come out to condemn this election. But you know how it is. This is election. You know, when you are declared winner, it is very difficult for things to be turned around. We have to wait for the next four years to write to 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 write uh, uh, to write wrong our, our mistakes. So that is the the, the, the the issue on ground. But the truth is, uh, Labour Party winning Lagos State shows that you know uh, the the kind of force, the the power that is embedded in the youth. That is that, and it also shows that the youth has woken up to to see that they can actually make a change in governance. That is what you know uh, 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 the victory of Labour Party you know has shown in Lagos State. Thank you for tuning in. Please feel free to comment below. Let's uh, know your thoughts concerning this, and also subscribe to our channel for update on this and more to come. Thank you.